Hello guys, I hope you are fine and doing perfectly well. In this video, I am going to show you how you can install WordPress in your uh, subfolder of the domain or subdirectory. Uh, let's say if your main domain is uh, website.com uh, and website.com has another website uh, in it and uh, WordPress installation as well definitely and uh, now you want to use another theme on your uh, like let's say website.com slash uh, you can say it a uh, new uh, theme or new website then you can install a new wordpress there and new theme and new plugins and it will look like and uh, to public it will look like like uh, like it's only one website uh, but in back end it will be more than one websites and uh, uh, more than one users and admins and uh, the back end as well so let me show you uh, by screen as well. So here I am in the cPanel uh, because uh, mostly you ne uh, need to do it from cPanel. Uh, that is very easy. Uh, when you will install the WordPress, there it asks you to uh, either you want to install it on the main uh, domain, primary domain, or on a subdomain. Like like if I go to WordPress here, we can. I am in cPanel as I have already told you. The easiest way to install a WordPress uh, website is uh, uh, from the cPanel and with Softa Close apps. Okay, so click on install. Here you can see that it will ask you to select either it is, it is HTTP or HTTPS. I will choose HTTPS and uh, because that is a secure connection uh, and then it will ask you to select the domains like I have this, uh, this domain uh, like let's say you can use your existing domain but don't worry it will not overwrite your existing installation like let's say if you have already a website on spability.com it will not overwrite why because here we will create a new folder that can be a sub page we can say that it is it will be a blog it will install a new wordpress on this uh, on this link like spability.com slash blog not on spability.com so uh, if i show you uh, what it will do it will install uh, wordpress on spability.com slash blog here it will install the new wordpress blog but it will not overwrite your existing wordpress website that is here so you can do as many installations as you uh, as you want like let's say you can make it blog uh, you can create a new link uh, you can create a new and there instead of blog you can write it uh, a portfolio website and like that so every every this uh, url will have a new wordpress installation in it so let me show you how it works uh, it it will work like that currently uh, let me show you spability Uh, this is my main site uh, that is spability.com and uh, let me check if it is th there something in the blog okay so i already have a blog page here that is the in the existing installation uh, what i will do is that i will uh, add here a blog 2023 so that it will be easy here you can choose any username any password any something uh, according to your uh, needs you can add any email or password that you want and uh, uh, you can select backups if you want to do that improve page speed speed cache uh, limit login attempts loginizer that is uh, we use this plugin for login, limit login uh, attempts this will be helpful for you uh, to secure make the website secure classic editor if you are uh, uh, are very addicted to use old version of the website uh, WordPress then I would suggest to use uh, install classic editor plugin uh, Lightspeed cache uh, to uh, delete and remove cache Elementor page builder to build website WP forms to create forms you can select all of these and then if you want you can select a theme from here as well uh, just for the text uh, I will select this theme so that it should also import the uh, text as well uh, this email I will remove that I will just add a dummy email and this will also add dummy because I will delete the installation after that okay and then I will click on install let's see how it goes it will take some time to install uh, this uh, I will pause this video uh, for that time of being okay 
so it's uh, yeah, been in installed let me uh, show you one minute let me open a new window here copy link address and here I will add the address that I told you you can see that here here now we are in the home page here you can see that it is here okay you can see that and here this is uh, the new installation that we did and here on the main domain is the real website that was already uh, there so using this method you can install as many as WordPress that you want and uh, everything uh, that will be helpful for you you can create more than one uh, website within the same domain if you wanted to do some test and uh, some staging staging sites you need you can do that as well so I hope my this video was helpful for you uh, if you need any help or any uh, uh, questions that comes into your mind you can ask me in questions or you can connect with me on Calendly uh, to, can, uh, to book an appointment or you can do any other means of way that you think uh, you need help and I'm also available on Fiverr and Upwork and uh, yeah so that's pretty it please like and subscribe my channel as well and uh, share uh, it with your friends and colleagues uh, if they need help related to WordPress and the websites thank you see you later bye bye allah